Yo, what's up guys, Super Today we're doing the quest Clock Tower. Oh, I just burped, sorry. Uh, this quest can be started by speaking to Brother Kojo at the Clock Tower entrance, which is located south of Ardoin. <coughs> Ardoin's right here. Clock Tower's right here. Pretty easy. What you gonna need? I just brought some food. This Varactyl doesn't matter. And all you really need is a bucket of water or ice gloves. So to start off, talk to Brother Kojo. I'm gonna fix my mic here really quick. There we go. Hello, monk. Uh, basically, this guy doesn't look too old. He needs you to sort out the cog issue. That should sort it out. <clears throat> All right, there we go. So, if you look at the RS quest guide, you're gonna have to fix some of the stuff. Make your way into this room over here, and you see these cogs. Climb your way down here, and there's gonna be a pretty massive entrance, or I mean, dungeon. Now, when you make your way northeast, <clears throat> let's actually run, you're going to see these tiles up here. These tiles will show you where each cog is located. So, white is northwest, black is north, uh, east, and then this, the blue is southwest, and red is southeast. And I'm going to show you how to get them all. Alright, so, take this door right here. Nope, wrong one. Take this door up here. I thought this one led up there for a second. And you're gonna be making the black cog. This is where your bucket of water comes in handy, or in which case, if you have ice gloves, you will not need a bucket of water. You're gonna come upon some scary ass fire. What you wanna do is use the bucket of water on the black cog and quickly take the black cog. And you should be good. Now run back, make sure you have the black cog in your inventory, and go back to the ladder where you started, you're going to be putting the black cog on the correct spindle, which is the east spindle. So these are the spindles, use the black cog on this one. Hopefully you're color coordinated and know where to put it. Now you need to run through some level 53 ogres, you guys should be alright depending on your HP. If you have 20 HP or better, you'll be totally fine. Basically, you're going to be running through this door, then south, and let's make our way over here. Where is it? There it is, right there. Take the red cog. If you have armor on, you should be fine. I've only got, I only took, what, one hit from them, so. Anyways, you're going to be taking this red cog to the second floor of the clock tower, so you know how we put the black cog on the basement one, you have to go up the ladder and then put it on the red one, which is facing north, but I'll just show you how to do it in case you guys are so confused. So let's climb up the ladder, and we'll put our red cog right here on this clock spindle. Cock this perfectly, very good, make our way back down. Okay, time for the white cog. Let's make our way to the area, so remember white is um, northwest, so make your way over here, this time open this, or go through this little area right here, take the rat poison, now follow the hallway east along the top, there's your white cog, but these rats will get in the way, so you have to kill them somehow. Do you guys want to make a guess? I think it's with the rat poison. Use, or don't use, pull each lever once. And this will enable you to go through without any problems. Use your rat poison on the trow. Trow. All these rats are going to be synchronized and then, poof, death. Open this gate. Take the white cog, climb up this ladder, <clears throat> and run your way in here. Now, open this door. Go up this staircase. And use this cog on the spindle facing west. 
Oops. <clears throat> oh, sorry. You need to go up all the way to the top. And use it on this spindle. My bad. Alright, now go back down to the first floor. Alright, so... You guys are going to want to make your way over to the bottom of the Ardoin Zoo. And now, one last time. It is not our Dugney. It is not our Dune. It is not our Dugney. It is our Doin. <laughs> I swear on my life it is. I, I've been told by millions of people it's a pronunciation guide. Okay, so... See this ladder right here? You can make your way down. Once you're there, you have to follow an extremely long path around. And I will probably fast forward this part out so you guys don't have to listen to my voice. And off we go. Okay, so push this wall, take the blue cog. And make your way up this ladder. Now make your way around here. And run up to the first floor. Or the, well, first floor of this house. Which is technically the second floor for US people. And first floor for people in Britain land. I'm not a, I'm not a total expert on the whole situation. But I know this floor is called the ground floor. I'm not sure if it's all of Europe or just in Britain, but if this is, no, that's first floor in the US. Why am I doing this? <laughs> and use the blue cog on the one that's facing south. Finally, make your way down and get your beast reward. Like, you guys will never see a better reward than this. And bam, you get 500 coins. Insane. And it, one whole quest point. Thanks for watching, guys. Pretty easy quest to do. Please leave a like for more quest guides. That hits me 130, 48 away, 47 away from getting Barrow's Gloves. So awesome stuff. Peace.